Hi, it's time for another video from my dream car news. Start dreaming. Here's a great video about the fabulous Ferrari 812 GTS. Enjoy. Exactly 50 years on from the debut of the last Spider in the Ferrari range to sport a front-mounted V12, the 812 GTS hails a triumphant return for a model type that has played a pivotal role in the Mark's history since its foundation. The Ferrari V12 Spider story features many iconic models and began in 1948 with the 166 mm, an authentic thoroughbred competition GT that won some of the most prestigious endurance races in the world in 1949, the Mill Milia and the 24 Hours of Le Mans. The last in that long lineage was the 1969-365 GTS 4, also known as the Daytona Spider because of Ferrari's legendary victory in the 1967-24 hours of Daytona, when two works 330p fours and the NART 412p took the checkered flag side by side to occupy the top three places. The front-mounted V12 architecture has not been used in the Ferrari series production Spider since the 365 GTS 4. That said, Four special series limited editions have been launched, the 550 Barchetta Pinin Farina in 2000, the Super America in 2005, the SA Aperta in 2010 and, most recently, the F60 America of which just 10 were built to celebrate Ferrari's 60th year on the American market in 2014. Like its historic predecessors, the 812 GTS sets a new benchmark in terms of performance and exclusivity. Sporting Ferrari's majestic 800 CV V12, it is not merely the most powerful production spider on the market, but also the most versatile, thanks to its retractable hard top, a unique feature in this segment which also guarantees a larger boot capacity. The retractable hard top, RHT, which opens in just 14 seconds at speeds of up to 45 km per hour, does not impinge upon the interior dimensions, thus maintaining the donor car's roomy cockpit. The electric rear screen, which acts as a wind stop, makes the car truly usable with the top down, and with the top up, it can be left open to allow the occupants to continue to luxuriate in the naturally aspirated V12's unique soundtrack. that has been the base generating the design of this car. So my team and I, working on the uh, Spider version, the GTS uh, of the A12, uh, decided to uh, stay faithful to this principle. And this has been possible thanks to the, to the adoption of the retractable art top. That is a modern way to interpret a Spider, very different compared to the latest uh, Spiders of the Ferrari history, especially the famous Daytona, the GTS version of the Daytona, where the principle was completely different. Normally, the derivative was done by chopping out the roof and creating completely different feeling. In the, most of the cases, losing this uh, beautiful fastback and very, very slim effect. So, and this creates the so-called cabriolet effect. So, in this case, the design is very modern, very dynamic, very sculptural. Everything, all the details and the buttresses has been treated consistently with the design of the rest of the car. The A12 GTS is the perfect combination of performance and driving emotions. The core elements from the technical point of view are a V12 engine and a retractable hardtop to create a spider version based on the A12 Superfast. Think about of the performance. 800 horsepower, 8.3 seconds from 0 to 200 kph. And on the other hand side, all these driving emotions. A V12 natural aspirated engine. The Ferrari music, the sound, combined with an open roof, the wind in your hairs. This is perfect harmony of performance and driving emotions. This is Ferrari, this is a new A12 GTS.
Ed eccoci con la 812 GTS, the new baby in our product range, completely in uh, a segment that was missing in the Ferrari product range since 50 years, something we are very proud of because, as you can see, it is uh, combining a great sporty coupe, but also with a beautiful and, uh, as uh, Flavio Manzoni was mentioning, elegant spider. it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my dream car news now. Spread the word. Keep dreaming.